Hey what's up you guys, welcome back to my channel, if you're new here, hi hello I'm Lydia and if you are new here make sure you hit the subscribe button, join the growing family, turn notifications on so you never miss an upload and give me a thumbs up while you're down there because it really does help me out. Now today I thought we could talk about beta blockers for anxiety. I don't currently take any beta blockers for my anxiety, I take a beta blocker for my POTS. I used to take propanolol for my anxiety and I've got a few things to say about it. So let's get on with the video. So my anxiety started when I was very young. Obviously I didn't know it was anxiety at the time, everyone just thought I was a bit shy. And yes I am, but I have crippling anxiety when it comes to talking in front of people. The only people I talk to regularly are my grandparents, Alana, my friend Aaron, Serenity, and my mom. They're the only people I feel comfortable talking to. Talking to a camera is different because I'm just talking to myself. About seven years ago, I was put onto propanolol. I'll put the name on screen for my anxiety. Now, it, it helped cal me calm down out of panic attacks, which was good. However, it didn't help with my anxiety. My anxiety was as bad as always. So it was a bit disappointing, to be honest. The next thing I tried was diazepam, which as you know, if you've seen my videos, if you haven't seen my medication videos, I'll link the playlist up there. Um, I was on diazepam for a year. Then I moved to London and I got put onto clonazepam and lorazepam. Um, I still take lorazepam PRN, I take clonazepam twice a day and they work for me. I've made loads of videos on benzos if you're interested. They will be linked on that playlist. Propanolol only helped with panic attacks for me, which I guess was a good thing, but I would much rather have been given something that actually helps with my anxiety than panic attacks. Even panic attacks are awful, I'm not downplaying how severe panic attacks are, so please don't get that impression. Out of the two, uh, severe anxiety and panic attacks, I'd rather have the anxiety dealt with. I know they don't like prescribing benzodiazepines, I, they just don't. Though, while I've lived in London, I've had no problem getting benzodiazepines off doctors. Because they know it works for me. <laughs> Which is good. Oh, I was on 80 milligrams of propanolol for anxiety. And honestly, it just wasn't for me. It wasn't the best medication I could have been on. If you are suffering from severe panic attacks, I would recommend propanolol. If you struggle with anxiety, then I wouldn't recommend propanolol. But yeah, that's my thought. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Peace.